Honestly, so, I don't yeah. know. I watched these guys play before, and the last time they played, it was 4 4 and uh, White Gun clutched it up. Yeah, yeah. See, yeah, that's what I, that's what I thought as well. So, let's see what happens this time. Hmm, they both go with Ultra 2, which makes sense. Combo bow. Yeah. Guaranteed damage. Alright, so match number one of the way. White Gun gets the overhead. Mm. Okay, Jazzera gets the first knockdown. Oh, oh option selected. Ooh, he did up. option selected, but it didn't work. Oh, uh, catches him with the kunai. Ooh, you'd be surprised. I thought he would know how to block his own character setup, but I guess it's just that ambiguous. And he gets the stun. And Jazz Dero takes round number one. He's about to owe me some money. The thing with this matchup is, it's all about momentum. And who gets the mix up going first? Who's the first person who's going to get that hard knockdown? Yeah. Like five different ways. Oh, miss. Why gun misses the punish? Goes to the overhead. Goes for the reset. Oh, Jazz Zero knows how to block it, but he still got hit in the front. Ooh, he excites security to relieve some of that pressure, but White Gun's still the in White there. Gun is just overheading. He realizes that Jazz Zero is pressing a lot of buttons during block pressure, so he's going for the overhead to get that damage. Okay. Overhead catches the back dash, and Jazz Zero gets his Vortex started up. Oh, nice job. I don't even know if that was a cross It might have just been a plain unblockable. I knew it was going to hit in front because he backed up a frame. Oh, oh gets the yeah. reset. The and, first perfect of the, the set the first already. perfect of the set. And that's one thing I wanted to say, too. I think there are going to be a lot of P's in this game. Mm-hmm. I feel like if I also watched Sesame Street, the letter of the day would be P because that's what I expect to see tonight. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> So good job from Jazz Darrow. It looks like I put my money in the right place. Definitely. But we'll see. It's only the first game. White Gun still has plenty of time to get started up. Um, honestly, I don't think there's going to be that many adjustments made in this set. Not only just because of the character, but the players as well. I think it's just going to come down to uh, who's going to just play better in the neutral and get that first knockdown. Right. And so far... You know, White Gun has done better in the neutral at the beginning, but Jazz comes back with his one knockdown and makes it count more than uh, White Gun has. Right. And that's mainly due to Jazz Darrow being able to block some of the Kunai mix-ups. White Gun has not been mm -hmm. successful in blocking the mix-up on knockdown. And guys, sure. remember, use hashtag UFN 2013 to have your tweets featured on the stream. Troll away, and you can get featured. So make sure to follow us on Twitter at SolidXPanda. I what is this? The fans right. want to see Flash House. Did Flash House just call itself a fan of himself? That's terrible. Respect that. Game number two underway. Let's see if Jazz Darrow can keep this momentum rolling. Coming off a perfect victory in the last round. And I'm already disappointed because there's not going to be a perfect this round. There's a lot of movement going on. Oh, that, that overhead whiff, that looked kind of weird. Oh, wow. Guess it's... Why, I whiffed again. Corner. Oh, no punish there. Nah, but he ca he catches the back dash. Oh, he tried to set something up and had a bad point. Catches the back dash again. Good block. Good block. And a good read from Jazz Darren. He takes round number one. Yeah, very dominant round from him. He kept White Gun in the corner the whole time, and once he got out, it still didn't make much of a difference. He still controlled most of the match. Good reaction with the uh, EX Kitty. Alright. Ooh, nice OS into the neckbreaker. Oh, it messes up his setup. 
And that's something you don't see happen much from White Gun, him messing up the setups. Uh, both <laughs> of them going for overheads, and, and this is this is whiffing on his own character. If you know, this is whiffed like three times. Yeah, it's been pretty interesting. I never seen that whiff like that. And he Ooh, goes for the ultra. The ultra. Oh, you know, I, I respect know. that because he hasn't been getting. You know, nobody's used it yet. Why not get the damage and the opportunity? But does she get a setup off of this? Not really. So maybe he shouldn't have used it. Oh, and Jazz Zero getting caught pressing buttons, and White Gun takes round number two. Yeah, these are two very busy players. They're both always doing something. I'm not saying you have to be lame, but sometimes right. you gotta know when to slow it down. Alright, so Jazz Zero gets a confirm into the neck breaker. Ooh. Uh, oh, he catches White Gun, dashing away. Oh, he OS's again, and it went. Uh, whoa, that went under the Kabuki's back dash. That was pretty dope. Right, she, can't like she, she can't option select herself. Oh, nice setup from White Gun. Goes right into the Ultra. Nice hit confirmed. He's going to get him down to maybe about 10%. Yeah, about 10% life. Can he finish it? Starts chipping. And I knew for a fact that both of them were going to slide. Mm hmm. I've seen I White Gun play before. I knew yeah. he was going to do it. But I didn't think Jazz would also I, do it. Right. I, honestly, either White Gun was gonna slide or go for the overhead because he was he knew that Jazz was gonna slide. Mm-hmm. Personally, so, I wouldn't match Ultra. Yeah. It doesn't always that? work, obviously, as I proved earlier, but right. I would have matched Ultra. <laughs> would have did it anyway. So good job from White Gun bringing things to even. Scores at one one. And yeah, this should I be have to, that, man. I have to use the bathroom. So, PXG IP, man. Be right back. <laughs> it, man. Hey, this should be a good long set here. White Gun and Jazz Zero notoriously go back and forth. So, it should be very entertaining for you guys. Non stop action. Actually, it might be a quick set just because of the amount of damage and stun that's going to go down. But I do think it will go down to the last game. So here we are with game three, white gun, player one side, rocking the dark Ibuki versus Jazz Zero's original color Ibuki. Oh, good air grab. Let's see what he gets off of this. Yep, White Gun trying to focus Dash his way out, but it didn't work. Jazz Zero adapting and choosing a different option select. Instead of going for the the neck breaker, he goes to uh, the Samuji, the spin kicks, to at least get some damage. Maybe an air reset or something. Good jump back, medium bunch, I think that was. Oh man, here's a knockdown. Good combo from White Gun. It's going to do a lot of damage. Not enough. It's almost there. Ooh, I respect that match, Ultra. I thought White Gun would have tried to slide there or maybe go for an overhead. So I don't blame Jazz Zero for going for that. The fight was basically over. Good whiff punish by White Gun. Another early jump on the setup. X neck breaker. Oh, that had to have been unblockable. I could not tell where that one was at. And White Gun runs right through Jazz Daryl. That was about a minute for two rounds. Jazz Daryl didn't even get a chance to do anything. White Gun, although you know he messed up some the the jump setup, he just didn't let that phase him and just kept running right through Jazz Daryl. Jazz Daryl could not stop the pressure. He's going to really have to start blocking those kunai mix-ups if he wants to stand a chance.
Shoutouts to Lestat. Shoutouts to TFX, I upload people without asking them, Kappa. Shoutouts to Onyx. Shoutouts to Vortex characters in Street Fighter 4. Alright here guys, we're going into game four. White gun is up. Two one in this first to five set. Jazzero didn't get a chance to do much last time, but let's see what he uh if he changes anything up this time. Oh good two hit jumping. Get the early knockdown. Ooh, crash medium punch canceled to neck breaker. Nice catching the back dash right there. And I respect that match by Jazz. He did not want White Gun to get started up. That's a nice setup though. Because uh, what he did was he whipped a button. And he could either instant kunai. Ooh, excellent catch of the back dash with the three-quarter screen net breaker. He whipped the button. And at that same time, he could either do a kunai. Or he could cross up with a dash. And he chose to cross up with the dash this time. That's going to be something to look out for later in the set. Oh wow, dash forward then cross up. Got a stun. Ooh, tries to mix it up into a throw maybe to get a, a better setup. But I think he should have just finished the combo. Match the Yikazakiri. And finishes it off. Another quick match. Jazz Zero shut down White Gun with what I thought he was going to do, which is uh, match DP instead of letting him pressure him for free. So maybe White Gun next time will be a little more careful, a little more respectful. But I hope not, because uh, if once he starts respecting Jazz Zero, then Jazz Zero is going to get a lot more from him. So he's going to have to either take the risk and keep pressuring him, or just uh, start trying to bait the DP. It's clip side. Shout out to Ryan Brandt. Shout out to having 480 viewers. Guys, don't forget to do the Tornado Jones contest. His beat arts are great. The question, the information is all in the chat right now. Answer the question to win some famous beat art. You can pick uh, almost any character you want and he'll do it for you. But who was the pole toting character that was supposed to be in Street Fighter 4 but didn't make it into the game in the end? Answer that question and tweet to Tornado Jones and you'll win some nice beat art. But White Gun's already down to about 5% of his health and gets destroyed by Daz Zero, and I missed it all. <laughs> I was so fast. Oh, now White Gun's getting started. Nice kunai setup. Misses the meaty. Oh, a stun already. And White Gun returns the favor with a quick round of his own. White Gun's got a lot of meter, so he could uh, use it for extra damage. Super chip. He's got a lot of options right here, but Jazz Zero not giving him a chance to use any of his meter. Drops the combo for the stun, though. And White Gun choosing to use his Ultra to even up the. Uh, 
life. Not sure if I agree with that. He gave Jazz Zero a lot of meter and his own ultra. This could be it. What's the mix up? Oh, he misses the option select again. Uh, I think Jazz should stop going for that. Oh, wow. Super jump. And that didn't even combo. But I think at that point, White Gun couldn't have done anything. Not with uh, maybe EX Neckbreaker to go under it. But good job by Jazz Zero. I think it all started with White Gun using that Ultra too early. Didn't give him a chance to keep his pressure going up and get that stun. The yo, 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 what did I miss? Uh, some quick rounds, man. Uh, I've already lost. Oh, who's track. winning? Oh, Jazz Zero's winning? Yeah, it should three be two? three from Jazz. Miss but these rounds are going over. by quick. There's no time to adapt or anything. These guys are just going at it. Yeah, I went I'm to the bathroom. It's IP, man. Early of Ultra 2, though. Like you get the damage. Uh -oh. but Look at that shirt. You see Panda shirt? We do have PXG shirts with the chicken wing panda. Make sure to go to facebook.com backslash panda x gaming or tinyurl.com backslash PXG store where you can see where you can get that, that sexy shirt. The ugly person wearing the sexy shirt. You want that shirt. Never mind the person wearing it. That person was hideous. Make sure to follow. There you go. And this is game number six, right? This is game number six. Yes, yeah, is game number six. Ooh, there we go. That's how most of the matches have started. Just the uh, empty canceling, crash medium punches, neck breaker. Ooh. Good job. Another P? Please, please give me that. I'm <laughs> Ah, come on, Jazz Dero. Technically, you lost that round. Yeah, I think White Gun needs to start resorting to mash DP. He hasn't been mashing DP. And really? uh, Jazz Dero's been pressuring him on the ground a lot. Good throw. Nice block. What's the setup? Oh, wow. Into cross up. I didn't see that coming. There you go, this is a match DP, stops the pressure. Yeah, makes him respect you a little bit more. Ooh, nice job. Woo! Yeah, I that was unblockable and excellent confirmed by White Gun. Very execution heavy, Abuki. He takes he it. Takes the round. Nice anti here. Good choice by jump back medium kick from Jazz Dero. Good air here. Oh, reads the back dash, but uh, doesn't get a punish. Nice read though. The yeah, X neck breaker. What's the setup? Thought he was gonna back dash, so. We went with jump hard punch, but oh, Jazz could throw it away. Getting really careless. Oh, two deaths. Yeah, it's the up kick. He's sitting on match point right now. Oh okay. god! Did you so, hear that? I read man's girlfriend watching. The did you hear that? Did y'all hear that? I just want to know that everybody hear that. Yeah, she's watching the Parkers, man. Show's pretty funny. She watching that UPN? Yo, she sounded like Ric Flair. Real talk. <laughs> Diamond. Diamond. Babe. Ice puzzle abuse has entered the building. Shut up.
So Jazz Zero is sitting on match point, and I checked out Twitter. Jazz Zero's Hispanic compadres from Mexico are cheering him on. Wait, Jazz Zero's playing from Mexico with an American flag? I think so. How? What? See how they bait us? Just like the Kraken beat. Gun doesn't use a Canadian flag either. Yeah, I'm pretty sure people would still play her, play him, but uh, I don't know. All right, here we go. Possible game set match for uh, Jazz Look, Zero. Full screen neck break. I don't agree with that. And White Gun. Senses that coming, so he goes for the overhead. And he converts into the vortex. Uh oh, someone's getting peed on. Close to getting uh -oh. stunned. Good back dash. Uh oh, someone's getting peed on. Please, please, white gun, don't get hit. Oh my! Oh, as soon as I that say was it. his chance right there. Oh my god! Oh, good bait on the reversal, but doesn't punish it. Oh no, I think uh, White Gun should have just went for uh, oh, Rock. What is this? Oh man, it's just. Oh, this is random. Yeah, they were just going nuts, man. <laughs> and the final... It's exciting to look at because for a second it looks like Marvel. Yeah, it was pretty insane. <laughs> My super jump cancel into Oh, perfect, Luigi. perfect. Come on, come on, white gun. Come on. Yo, convert. Come on, white gun. Can he finish the combo this time? Yes. Go no. Back. Oh, my God. Okay. Ooh, okay. almost. I give up. And so white gun to needs it to uh, a 4 2 match. 4 3 it's nothing actually. But it's nothing but a tease. Almost made me drop. We don't have any grudge matches tonight, do we? This is a grudge match. This is a grudge match? Oh, I thought they were cool. I thought they went back and forth and just played. I mean, it's not. The match, the word grudge is thrown around loosely. That's all I I see that now. You know what I hate when I'm going down my Instagram feed and I just see a giant close up. Of what? Like, just of your face, like back up, man. Of my face? Of any of a person's face. Oh. Like you don't even look that good. Yeah, like <laughs> step it back, use a better filter, and take it easy. Shots fired. All right, so Jazz Zero still sitting on match point. White Gun trying to bring it back. Closes, uh, hmm. Shortens the gap. And White Gun gets the oh, voice stun. Oh, away from a stun. Come on, White Gun. Get that perfect. Get that perfect. Oh my, yo, Jazz, oh my God. I respect that. I respect that mash. I don't. Uh, Terrible use of me. Oh, wait. Wins. Not nice if you win this round, it's not. Ooh, that is a good mash. He messes up his kunai setup. Doesn't get punished though, so it's not that bad. And random neck breaker.
Wait, what was that? Whoa! Whoa, this is just... I don't know what's going on. I think Jazz Zero is mentally broken. This is a little beyond unorthodox. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. So Waikan ties it up. So I, like I called it last game, these guys always go back and forth. So let's see if White Gun's momentum will carry him to the victory, or if Jazz Zero can stop the bleeding and take the victory for himself. It's going down to the wire. I expect nothing less from these guys. Uh oh, Tear Legend exposing Ferris. Oh, you missed some of the funniest stuff ever the other night for you guys. I have to tell it to you off stream. You met me and me and Melo probably laughed for a total of two hours straight. Like legit laughing. For a total of two hours. Two hours? Yes. I laughed, man. It was really funny. Me and my laugh for about two hours at Ferris. I'm sorry. Good, funny. I couldn't help it. Just Ferris. All right, so match point for both players. Oh Let's man. See if Jazz Zero can regain his composure. He draws first blood. White Gun has been loving that overhead in the set. Yeah, he has. That move needs more recovery, man. He's just going nuts with it. I don't know what's going on. There's like a lot of movement going on. Yeah, they're, they're busy, man. They never want to stop doing stuff. He gets a knockdown. More execution errors than I'm used to seeing from these two players. Exactly. And White Gun takes the first round. This is... This it's is not that bad, out. though. Alright. Jazz is a meter lead. A lot of overheads. But Jazz gets the first knockdown. See what he can make out of this. Nice block from White Gun. Nice cross up from Jazz Zero. Gets a hard knockdown. He gets a cross up. This could be it. It's the OS, and this is going down to last game, last round for the match. I'm really surprised that, you know, White Gun hasn't just decided to block because he's been getting options selected. <laughs> I mean. Uh, I'm trying to give him the benefit of doubt, but we exile security. This could be the. Oh man! What? Jazz That's got overhead. three more Kazakiris. Oh, I don't agree with nice that. Nice setup! Meters. Oh my god, that would. Have... And Jazz Zero oh, takes the, stun? the set. And Jazz Zero uh, takes the set. Five four. Wow! And last set they had White Gun won five four. I told you, these guys are dead even. Nobody can say one is better than the other. You can prefer one over the other, but they keep going this even.